Okay guys, let's get into this white bean chili that I made. It is super full of protein because I'm going to a birth soon. Like 99% of my recipes, we're going to start with some onion and the fat. I used avocado oil today. Then we're gonna add our garlic and some pepper. We're using poblano peppers. You can also use um, canned green chilies in this if you'd like, but I just wanted the um, fresh poblano taste instead. Then you're going to add your seasonings and some bouillon cubes. Of course, I'm using my not chicken bouillon cubes. And then here's where things get weird, but hear me out. So I made a roux using a scoop of pea protein um, instead of flour. Like I said, I'm going to a birth today, so I wanna make sure that I'm super full of nutrients and on uh, something that's gonna sustain me throughout the evening, um, as I might not be eating a whole lot today. Next, we're gonna add our beans, some corn, and some water to the consistency that you like and then you're just going to add some more seasonings like I use some chili um, seasonings like chili ancho chili peppers um, etc etc paprika garlic all of the stuff I you know all of the seasonings and then you just let this simmer down until you get it to the consistency that you like and then you eat up all right, so here's my finished product. It was really, really delicious. Um, if you aren't looking to up your protein, of course you could use regular flour instead of the pea protein to make your roux like any normal person would. Or you could skip the roux and instead you could go with a um, with vegan cream cheese or regular cream cheese because that's what the um, actual white chili recipe calls for is cream cheese. So here was a good idea, it hit, um, I didn't really have any instructions or anything, I just went for it.